You know what I'm saying? Make right. sure your kids straight off the albums when you when you're not around no more. Y'all still be able to get the residuals, and it ain't no, it ain't up for grabs. Like who, who can sign off on this, or who who uh who own the masters, and you know what I'm saying? Who right. own the rights to his music? Like you got to get that squared away right now while you popping, while you popping. You use that for leverage with the label. Like man, let me see them contracts. Right. Man, who own these songs? Man, who own who own these masters? Like, how much I owe y'all now? After right. every album, you need to audit the, the label and tell them how much how much I owe you. Like, so because they'll tell you after the fourth album on the, or you owe us for the first album, or what about the and studio session you booked? Now? What <laughs> about those buses, or the 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 flights we took care of, and your friends and your hotels and the food, and then that started being a big bill. But you on the fifth album. Now you're on your fifth album, but they're telling you about a bill from the second album and the first albums and the third album to get you to sign again or whatever, whatever, to get some more money out you. Or... Why the fuck is my forehead so goddamn shiny? I'm not even sweating. Fucking <clears throat> Windex head ass nigga. My ducks, my swans, welcome to the pod. My name is Dorian from Group82Music.com. Right here, we got Future talking about how record labels finesse artists into signing bad deals. I want y'all to really listen to what he said right here. He said after every album, you need to ask the label, how much do I owe you? Not how much did we make. You need to ask the record label, how much do I owe you? This is what you're doing when you sign to a record label. You got your art, you got your music, you got your talent, and what they're doing is they are giving you money as venture debt for you to market your music and your talent. They're going to help you with that. And in every single thing that you do to market your music, they're going to charge you for that. If you got a hotel on the road, they're charging you for that. If it's a big label dinner where they're celebrating you, they're charging you for that. Private flights, commercial flights, charging you for that. Anything that you could possibly think of, they're going to charge you for that because this is what record labels do. And not only do they charge you what you actually incurred, they're gonna charge more because they know they can take it from you because there's nothing that you can fucking do. This is why you don't need to sign to a record label unless you have leverage, unless you have power, unless you know exactly what you're doing. Too many of y'all wanna sign to a record label because you want somebody to do the work for you as opposed to being an independent artist who does this shit on their own. If you're somebody who is ready to do this shit on your own and you don't want anybody to do anything for you and you ain't trying to get charged for your own shit, click the link in the bio, purchase one of our packages for 60% off right now. I'm out the pod. Y'all stay true.